Hi guys, if you're like me, you're looking forward to any new operating system that's uh, being released. This time Catalina is a big upgrade um, and you might want to think twice before making that upgrade because we're going from 32-bit to 64-bit and what that means is that a few apps are not going to be working anymore. Now, I thought that that's only going to be, you know, that was only going to be like one or two apps that were not screenwriting related. But then when I looked at in the list, um, it turned out there was quite a few that I'm using that uh, will stop working after the upgrade. So to find out which are installed on your machine, you go to the Apple logo top left of the screen. You go to about this Mac system report. And then don't worry about hardware network. You go to software, legacy software. And there you have the whole list. Now that doesn't seem to be too much and it looks like there's only Caltex, but you gotta open it up and there is a whole lot more. Um, in fact, so there's Caltex, this um, power structure, the old power structure won't work any longer. Um, Scrivener 1 and 2, so you need to upgrade to Scrivener 3. Text Wrangler, there's a new app that's free that's called um, uh, BB Edit, I think, Bare Bones Edit, and you'll find it in the App Store. Movie Outline by Nuvutech. Um, my version of Open Office will stop working. So yeah, as you can see, there's quite a few apps and you might want to check that out before you make the upgrade because once you're there, there is no way back.